If you had to name a place to be the face of the Old West, that place would have to be Dodge City. The name itself conjures up images of cowboys and cattle drives, gunfighters and gun smoke. I'm standing here in front of the Long Branch Saloon at historic Boot Hill, but I'm not here to talk about the past. Dodge City is the face of the New West, and I'm here to take you on a journey into the future and show you how the power of purpose is transforming a company, an industry, and our world. It's all about riding for the brand, the power of purposeful leadership. Servitech was founded by three farmer-owned cooperatives in 1975 to provide new and needed services in agriculture, crop consulting, and laboratory analysis. When the company celebrated its 30-year anniversary in 2005, its footprint included 1 million acres under contract with over 1,800 producers in six states. It also had three state-of-the-art laboratories located in Dodge City, Kansas, Hastings, Nebraska, and Amarillo, Texas, that provided a variety of sample analysis for customers around the world. Servitech's first 30 years were phenomenally successful, but what about the next 30 years? I first found out about Jim Witt through a book that was given to me by Bob Workman called Writing for the Brand. And uh, uh, just so happened by coincidence that I was able to meet Jim in person about two months after I received the book. And about a year later, I got Jim involved with the company. I think the book was the catalyst of, of driving me to explore further what Jim could do for Servitech. That was the beginning of an organizational development process that included a 30-year plan to make Servitech even more successful. That process is based on the principles found in writing for the brand. After the first meeting with Jim, you know, I was somewhat challenged to uh, try to figure out what Servitech's purpose was, why we were in business, why we were doing what we were doing, and uh, it, it took a while. That's not something that uh, I guess if it was easy, uh, we would have figured it out a long time ago. They challenged me and some of the managers to look further into the future and uh, to decide where it is we needed to go and how we needed to get there and we didn't have a process to make that happen. So Jim helped us with that process to make that become a reality and it, it eventually uh, turned into a complete uh, reorganization of the, of the company. Servitech in the last uh, five years and Jim's been working with us almost five years now has uh, actually increased our revenue 50 percent. Servitech is following four basic principles from writing for the brand purpose, partnering, pioneering, and profit. Servitech's purpose is to make the planet more productive. It's projected that the world's population will swell to 9 billion people by the year 2050. Food production will have to double to feed those people. Servitech can't do that alone and doesn't want to. They want to partner with others to form an army of hunger fighters. The path Servitech will follow the next 30 years is much different than the one followed in its first 30 years. They are pioneering new technologies to lead the 21st century green revolution. Revenues have increased by 50% in the first five years of Servitech's 30-year plan, but the focus has not been on making money. Profit is a byproduct of purpose, partnering, and pioneering. In the Old West, a brand not only identified a ranch's cattle, it was a symbol of pride and loyalty for all its cowboys. They rode for the brand. Today, people want more from their work than paychecks. They want to be partners in a cause that is purposeful, heroic, adventurous, and idealistic. Like cowboys of yesteryear, they want to ride for the brand.